substance may be extremely toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description of the Varian structure. Any attempt to use it would result in countless lives lost. It must be recovered. Further information, current status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us, with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. To counter that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Your GRE-issued radio can overcome that jamming. It is your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file in order to save mankind from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. I told you it wasn't a normal drop shoot. Break his legs, then take him to rides. Back up! All of you! Stop! Loud noises draw them! Fall back! Fall back! You pinch him. You're scared. You're not scared. Then pinch him. He blinked. What? He blinked again. What if he's a zombie? Ah! Run! Run!
sleep for three days like a dead man and scare children? Off to a great start, Tony. Where am I? In paradise, can't you see? Okay, enough joking around. Head to room 190. The boss will brief you. What do you mean, 31? Ask the boss. Thirty-one. That's your number. Excuse me? Your number. You're the thirty-first infected. I'm the eighteenth. Everything is counted here. One fewer doses of antizin. One more new infected. One more runner gone. Thirty-one infected. Only seven months. Hey, where's room 190? Upstairs. We're just getting picked off, one by one. I'm looking for the boss. Is he in there? Oh, you're 31. Go on in. I'm looking for the... Are you the boss? What, am I too young? You got the problem with my age? No, I... You wanted to talk to me? That's better. Did you remember anything? Know what you are? Yeah, I can, I can see this is some kind of shelter. We call it the Tower. Brecken and his runners put it all together a couple of months ago, and we've been here ever since. Hunting airdrops, scavenging, and rescuing people. Yeah, I, I wanted to thank that girl. Good. Because if not for her, you'd already be chewing somebody's knee bone. Your antison was totally crushed, by the way. Only thing Jade could salvage was your radio. Oh, great. So can I get that back, please? Actually, I think I need it more than you do. Believe me, pal, that's not the case. Fine. Take it. You know why runners put their lives in danger? For guys like you. So now you take the antizin meant for someone else, and you won't even share your gear with us? I don't have time to deal with your bullshit. I've lost contact with one of our guys thanks to the fucked up radios we're stuck with. Do something for me, would you? I don't want to see you or your precious radio anymore, so go be useful somewhere else. We don't tolerate lazy assholes here in the tower. Hey, be fair. I'm not, I'm not lazy. I'm just... Hey, boss. Save it. That last guy I mentioned, he's only on the 13th floor, but he might as well be trapped in a mine cave -in. Come back later. And I'm not the boss. Too young, remember? I'm Rahim. Brecken's in charge here. I'm not lazy, you little shit. Where do you think you're going? The 13th floor. Get some stuff for Raheem. 13? Shit. That's gonna be some dirty work. 
But we all got to pull our weight around here, huh? Thing. I, I got bitten. I've shown no symptoms, but the people here say I'm infected. Then you'd better get your hands on some antis and ASAP. No! Help! Help! Somebody! What the hell? Jesus, you, you all right, man? I cut my arm, getting away from him. Oh, God. You had to kill him, didn't you? God damn it! That was... That was my brother. I came down to see him and... Easy, easy. It's all right now. I'll, I'll get help. Hey, Raheem, this is Crane. I'm down here on 13. Listen, this guy here got fucked up pretty bad getting away from a zombie. Yeah, it's safe enough now. Okay, don't move. I'm sending Lena downstairs. Hey, hold still. Lena will be here any minute. Boss, you've got to find some goss. And I'll go home. Combine them. That will stop the beating. Try to stay calm, okay? I'll be right back.
Okay, I think that's everything I'm gonna find. Let's give this a shot. Okay, who's hurt? He's bleeding pretty bad. Let me see him. Goes in alcohol, huh? Pretty primitive, but it'll work. Thanks for the help. I'll take care of him from here. Well done, 31. I just want to help out and repay you guys for what you did for me. Well, good. Come find me, and we'll talk about how you can do that. Taken care of. Piece of cake. What else you got for me? Well, let me think. Rahim, you are just smart enough to be dangerous, you know that? Omar told me about your plans for the nest. Explosive charges? Really? What? Explosives? Oh, never please. Said that. You can't tell a convincing lie to save your life. You know what I'm doing. Yeah? You think you can't die? You're not my mom. No, I'm not. Our mom's dead. So you might want to be a little nicer to me since I'm the only family you have left. Especially now that Amir is gone. You're Jade, right? Right. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for me and, and tell you how sorry I am for your loss. I owe you and Amir my life. Yeah, you do. You want to return the favor? Keep my dipshit brother from killing himself. No explosives, Rahim. So, is that enough? Do I get to talk to Brecken now? First, go change your clothes. I left some new ones for you in your room. You're in 194. Something wrong with what I'm wearing? You need something that fits the job Brecken wants you to do. Call me when you've changed. Things are getting worse and worse.
Okay, Raheem, I'm ready. Where do I find Brecken? Not so fast, 31. If you're going to earn your keep, we have to find out if you've got the skills. So get your ass up to the gym. Gym? What are you talking about? It's on the top floor. Just a couple flights up. Anyway, how are zombies like computers? Like computers. Oh, I give up. Raheem, I don't see you. Where are you? Welcome to our gym. First things first, you've got to learn how to run. What do you mean, learn how to run? Just do what I say, alright? Now, jump down to the very bottom. Are you nuts? I'd kill myself! Don't be a wimp. Come on, you can't be serious! Watch this. Raheem! My leg! Jesus, don't move! I'll get help! Ah, I was just fucking with you! Son of a bitch! What? You can't take a joke? Come on! Get your ass down here! Christ on a crutch. <laughs> Holy shit! Holy shit! It's a rush, isn't it? Don't blow your load just yet. There's more. 
To survive outside, you've got to take advantage of the terrain. Most eaters suck at climbing, so the harder the terrain is, the better for you. I've got some typical situations set up for you. Let's see how you handle them.
this natural talisman. I did that. You've done this before. You've done this before? Hardly. The closest I ever came to this was running track in high school. <laughs> well, then you're a fucking prodigy. Never seen anything like it. Raheem, what the fuck was that? Does this mean I'm, I'm turning? Most likely no. At least not yet. Caesars reminds you that you're infected. You better go see Dr. Zera though. He'll check you out, probably give you a shot of antizen. Before you head out to see Zera, talk to the quartermaster. He'll uh, gear you up so you can go outside without getting your head bitten off. Well, what are you waiting for? Get a move on. Alright, they've given me an actual job, and nobody suspects I'm not who I say I am. So far, so good. And once Dr. Zara helps me manage these symptoms I'm dealing with, I'll be even better.
Oh, you're the new scout. Rockin' radioed me about you. Yeah, that's me. Name's Crane. I'm not gonna bother learning your name till you survive a few days, but here, this is for you. By the way, word around the town is you're just another deadbeat in life for food or antizen. By which I mean, the people here don't much like you, but don't blame them. It's easy to get paranoid when you're isolated. And since somebody's jamming communication to the outside, there's plenty of paranoia to go around. Whole damn city with nobody to call for help but ourselves. You bring me some supplies from the air traps, though, and you see people change their tools in a hurry. That shit's a game changer. Uh, thanks. Bear that in mind. Listen, is there anything else? I'm in a bit of a rush. Also, if you're looking to get more popular, you can try helping folks. Do a few favors, they might like you more. Might even find a woman. Keep you warm at night. <laughs> Outside, yeah. Okay, new guy, be careful out there. We've lost too many already. Kid. All right, all right. Just 
Doctor? Hello? Are you there? Uh, so, I'm supposed to get a vaccine? Oh, no, no. Suppressive. It's called antism. Suppresses the symptoms. Here, see. Antism postpones the inevitable. Guess the jury could... Inevitable? So, there's no cure? It's a variation of rabies. There's no cure right now. But you see, I've been running tests on both antisin and infected tissue. Cure is possible. Definitely possible. You really think you can figure it out? Dr. Camden's help, yes. I think so. Uh, I would like to put that injector. Who's Dr. Camden? A colleague trapped in Sector Zero, where the outbreak first broke out. We've been collaborating via radio. Though we would have made more progress if the connection were better. Also, if my earlier experiments had borne fruit, I tried injecting recombined versions of the virus into chunks of meat and leaving them around the city, hoping some of the infected would eat them so I could observe and document the results. But they didn't. hold any antisen in reserve now. In any case, all right, I'm quite busy. It's on your way. Hello? 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 Thank you.